In this video, we're going to be talking about bottom dollar food. A defunct food store that was kind of like Aldi's. Bottom dollar food was founded in September of 2005 in High Point, North Carolina. This would be for many, several more years until 2015. When Bomb the Dollar would go out of business. It was part of the Dell Hayes Company. And this was their... Their, uh... Example of what Aldi... What they would... Their attempt at an Aldi type store, I meant to say. Things were going well for... Bottom Dollar Food. For many years... Opening stores in Virginia, West Virginia, Maryland, North Carolina, and many more states by 2010. Around that time, they had 30 locations. Around that time, Del Hayes also opened up a, a higher-end grocery store called Bloom. Around the time, they opened up Bother and Dollar Food as well. By 2010, they operated in other stores as well. By 2011, they operated in Philadelphia, where they had struggles with supermarket chains of the likes of Aldi's, Save-A-Lot, and Price Right. Many of these stores were well established in the Philadelphia area, so they started to open up more of the bottom dollar stores and markets where there was other discount grocery stores. People just weren't coming to the bottom dollar food. Many of the practices operated at bottom dollar food were the same thing as you could find at Aldi's or Save-A-Lot or Price Right. Bottom dollar also carried a lot of their own brands as well as national brands as well. They really didn't differ their stores from the rest. At its site, they had 46 stores. There was several attempts to bring back Bob and Dollar food, but the attempts were always unsuccessful, as there's just too much competition in the world of discount supermarkets. Eventually, all these stores will become Aldi's eventually anyway, or some were subdivided between Dollar General and other uses. But this is the history of Bottom Dollar food.